Hi, I'm Oriana Leo with the Red Carpet Report. Today we're in Beverly Hills for the fourth and final season premiere of Banshee. Oh, it's, it's a nice mic. Isn't it nice? It's yeah. shiny. So I was a, I started the hashtag Bunker Babes because cool. I actually had the conversation that there is such thing as a hot Nazi, at least in fiction. Oh, wow. So um, I'm really worried about your character and how Good. you're threatening my favorite baby bunker. Yeah. Um, can yeah. you can you give us any insight into at least the relationship that we're going to see this this season? Yeah, it's going to get bloody. Oh, yeah. It's going to get bloody, and, uh, and it's going to get bloody really quickly, like tonight. Like right, like right away. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, is there anyone left standing at the end of the season? I know you can't tell me, but I mean, oh. there's one person living? No, I don't think, I, I don't follow those rules. I'll tell you right now, no, we're all dead. Yes! We're all dead. <laughs> and in fact, at the, on the finale, when we all die, I think they set it up to where everybody's televisions are going to explode, too. <gasps> yes! Yeah. Like so it's new, like, yes. It's like 4D. We're all going to die with you. Exactly. Gonna That's right. <laughs> Fancy forever. No, did you have to do any special preparation for this role? I mean, I'm guessing you're not um, steeped in white supremacist lore before yeah, you got yeah. the role. No, I went down, uh, I, I went down and hung out in Mississippi for a while mm -hmm. and kind of, learned the ropes okay. as best I could. No, um, truth is, is that unfortunately, not unfortunately, but I grew up in the South mm -hmm. and kind of... Uh, what, what state? Florida. I was born in Kentucky okay. and then grew up in Florida. Um, and I unfortunately grew up with a kid who was the son of like the leader of the Aryan Brotherhood in wow. our town. I went to high school with this kid. Wow. Okay. Um, and he... It's really real for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially because I was more like my... I was more like Tommy. I was like against this kid in high school yeah. because he, you know, unfortunately was like brought up by this man and believed in that, sure. those philosophies, which like in a lot of ways, that's Calvin. Calvin isn't a, isn't a bad dude. He's just a guy who grew up with these philosophies kind of just burned into him sure. every day. He didn't really have a choice to turn out any other way. At all. Right. Yeah, exactly. Um, and that's, that was my favorite part about playing him was that like play against all of those stereotypes. Sure. Don't make him like this tough guy, jerk. Family man. Yeah, like he's who he, is. Right. he cares most about his wife and his kid right. and providing for them. And this happens to be what he's really good at. Right. Well, I'm I'm scared honestly mm -hmm. because I don't want to see I don't want to see Bunker hurt. Um, but more importantly, right. it's such a re it's so real. Um, I feel like the emotions between you guys. What was it like working together in those scenes? Tough cuz we have a really strong affinity for each other. We, we totally fell in love. Um, before this season even started, when we were doing the blowtorch stuff, me and him hung out, and it was like, oh, shit, this is going to suck, because I really like you. The blowtorch uh, burning off of his right, tattoo. Exactly. Yeah. Ouch. That was yeah. a real torch, too. But not real fire, I hope. No, no, real fire. But then they trusted me to let go of the button right before I got to him. And I trusted myself to do so, too, because I don't know if you've met Tom, but he's pretty big. <laughs> and, uh, I actually was, haven't. Only he interviewed him over the phone. He was not going to stand for that. He oh. was not going to, yeah. Well, uh, finally, we are giving an homage to Brock's beard. Oh, Brock's beard. Yeah, so uh, let's take a picture. Wait, how, how do I do that? Yeah, like that. There we go. Cool. May is, yeah, I haven't seen, he's so cleaved good. shaven, I hear. He so. is, yeah, he's on his way. I think he just got off a plane. We'll see him, we'll see him later. Thanks That's for right. stopping. Oh, we'll, I can't wait so to nice see, to see the episode. No. I wish, no, we're going to use it on After Buzz. Okay. Maybe we can interview you this season? Yeah, I'm up Will you be anything. in town or yeah, yeah, on I the phone? Here. Awesome, okay, yeah, I'll be in touch. It. Okay, yeah, cool. cool, have and fun it tonight. It's going to be scary. Okay. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this interview, give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos, and leave a comment for me below. Who's your favorite character on Banshee? Mine is Job forever. Until next time, I'm Oriana Leo with the Red Carpet Report.